Hey there, today we're going to talk about QR codes, how to make them and how to use them. A QR code is a barcode that can be read by your phone or by your tablet and it usually carries information like taking to a website, but sometimes it can carry other information there as well. Alright, let's get started. The first thing that we're going to do is we're going to go to a website called goqr.me. Now, goqr.me is a code generator site. It's one of many, many, many different sites that can do this. I like this site because it's easy and user-friendly. And you can see there's a bunch of different categories we can use. But we're going to stick to URLs. This is probably what you're going to use. So I'm going to type in a URL here. And if you notice on the side, the QR code is constantly changing. So it's updating for us. Now, I could scan that right now and it would take us to the site. That's not going to do me a lot of good. So let's download it. So you can do change settings here. We can make it bigger, we can make it smaller. Generally, you're gonna keep the same size, the 400 pixels. Download it as a JPEG or a PNG. It honestly doesn't matter, you can download either one. You can also change the color as well, but keep it black and white. Sometimes code readers have a little trouble with if the QR code's a different color. All right, so just went to our regular download folder. Double click it open and that's our QR code. We can put that in a Word doc, a Google doc, or we can put it on a website for, for someone to scan. All right, let's print out this code and see what happens. So I'm taking my iPad here and I'm opening up the scan app. You can find these apps on Google Play or the App Store, they're free. I'm gonna scan the barcode. And if you see, once the barcode scans, it takes me right to the site that I wanted. Quick and easy. That about does it. Now, if you have any questions, feel free to contact me. Now, go use this in your classroom and have fun teaching.